Tens of thousands of Taiwanese protesters rallied day and night outside parliament as lawmakers inside traded insults, blows and theatrics over a series of bills to expand the legislature's power. The issue has dominated conversations on the self-ruled island for the past week, eclipsing news of Beijing launching military drills around Taiwan to punish President Lai ching ti China, which claims Taiwan as part of its territory, said Lai's inauguration speech was a confession of independence after he was sworn into office Monday. As Chinese planes and warships encircled the island, tens of thousands thronged the streets around Taipei's parliament urging people to defend democracy on a different front. At issue are five bills currently making their way through parliament, proposed by Taiwan's largest opposition Kuomintang, KMT, party, regarded as pro-Beijing, and the upstart Taiwan People's Party, TPP. The law's proponents say they are needed to curb corruption. The ruling Democratic Progressive Party, DPP, claims the laws are being pushed through without proper consultation. Among the most controversial is a contempt of parliament offence, effectively criminalising officials unwilling to cooperate with legislative investigations, which critics say could be motivated by subjective politics. Democratic Taiwan has a raucous political environment. While its presidency has been under the administration of the DPP since 2016, no single party currently holds a majority in parliament, the legislative yuan, which could spell trouble for Lai. In the evening, DPP lawmakers released a slew of blue and white balloons, the colors of the opposition coalition, that had the words against evil laws scrawled on them. The mainstream public opinion is that the executive and legislative powers can supervise and balance.